Hello everyone, this is Tandaris and welcome back to Tandaris Gaming and it is Steam Next Fest everyone and today we are going to be trying one of the demos. I've got a whole proliferate of them, I'm going to try and get through as many as I can in the week of Next Fest which starts on the 21st which was yesterday and runs to the 28th which is next Monday. Definitely get on there and grab, there are some amazing demos up there and we will be taking a look specifically at a couple of kind of puzzle role playing open worlds some city builders and some simulation games so today's one that we're looking at is one more island um loving the cute graphic style on this so we'll see how it goes i'm also being deafened by the music so hopefully i'm not shouting at you as well right let's get started on medium sounds good to me Starting game. Game starting. I don't know why I read that the other way around. Ooh, ooh, can we pause? Pause. Aha. Welcome to your new island, Governor. The Queen will arrive shortly to welcome you. Would you like me to show you how to get started? Um. Yeah, why not? New colony, but first things first, some instructions to move around. Got that. Adjust the speed to there. Hire some workers. Go to the market. Hire workers. Eight. Workers help you build this colony. In exchange for some bread, you can hire additional workers at the market. How much food have I got? Fertility. That's the fertility. Okay. Centre island. Ooh. Oh, okay. Hang on. I suspect I am on an island. Oh, there's a port. And I have a farm. And a little mini island there. Okay, this is interesting. I have some workers. How many? I think I need to hire 20. <laughs> right, done it. Workers wanted to eat. Fish is enough for now, but they'll soon want more. Production chains consist of one or more multiple zones that produce goods. Zones only function when all requirements are met. Okay. Zone. Fish are friends, not food. No, they're not the food. Let's take care of food production first. Build a fishing zone. Fisher zone. I need to place it along the bank. Okay. Ooh. There. Oh, what does it want now? Zone and building. The fisher zone needs a fishing rod, barrel, and a life buoy, as well as a worker. Select an object to start building. Barrel. Yep, fishing rod. Uh, I think I need to turn that around. R. Fishing rod. Life buoy. Plus a worker. Okay. Now what? All oh, right. Okay. I need to unpause because I need to come and build some stuff. Well. Oh, there we go. Crazy people. Hey, look, I've got a fishing person. Building materials, woodcutter. Set up a wood production chain. All right. Make it eight by eight tiles. Wow, that's quite big. Where should I build it? Yep, okay. Uh, zones. Woodcutter zone. Oh, nine, ten, eight by eight. Worker. To produce the logs, you need a sawmill. Buildings require foundations before you can build walls and certain objects. A sawmill needs a three by four area with a wall around it. Just the demo version. Well, don't get ratty with me, missus. We're just sharing the demo for now. Although I quite like that, that was quite cute. Right, so what am I... Oh no, pretty. 
It's on a 3x4 area with a wall around it. It's not a zone then. Oh, foundation. There we go. 3x4 with a wall. Oh, do I need a stone? Stone mine. Oh, sawmill. Okay. Three by four. <laughs> now, new or incomplete zones show the missing requirements to complete the zone. Right, foundation. Directly enclosed an area. Okay. Oh. Okay, right. Drag that out. And then a door. Door. John Watson, you are doing something with a tree. Right, so I need a crate and a saw table and a small table and a wooden container. Right. That should be everything in there now. I hope. I'm kinda liking this actually. I like the mechanics of it. I like the fact we're zoning areas. It kind of reminds me of um, Prison Architect actually. Oh, 1721. Okay, fair enough. Although, I don't remember building this path. I think they've built paths automatically. Um, it's a shame because I've put the door on the other side. <laughs> Whoops. Right, blocker. There he is. He is now going to make wood. Okay, so logs go into there, wood goes into there. Got it. On the top right, you can see how many idle workers you have and how many building materials are on the island. For some objects, you also need rough stone. Luckily, there is a deposit on the island where you can mine good quality stone. How would this game look on your wish list? Shush you. Right. This cliff contains stone deposit. Build a stone mine zone directly adjacent to the stone deposit. Okay. Stone mine. How big does it need to be? Uh, it's suggesting that I need a mine crate and a stone mine. Now place a stone mine so place a build crate and assign a worker. Oh yeah. Assign a worker. Like the fact also in here is expand the zone if you need to make it bigger, which is good. Wood and stone. Yay, right, we've got a stone mine. If you're ever looking for more resource deposits, you can cycle through them by clicking this panel. Guards! Take away this filthy peasant! What? This is the new governor? Well, pleased to meet you, governor. That's quite a title for one of those greedy colonists, but sure, I'll play along. Your task 
is to set up a thriving colony. We all think you can do it. Really? Well, stop bothering me and start expanding my empire. Shoo! Oh. She's a real treat, indeed. I see you've met the Queen. Delightful, isn't she? From what I've heard, she won't bother new colonists too much, but once you get your colony up and going... Yes. You wouldn't be the first to try to declare independence, but I don't think anyone succeeded yet. Uh, can we declare independence? I wonder. That would be interesting. Your workers would love some bread. Let's first expand the farm to produce more wheat. Set the farm. Set the farm. Yep. There we go. Expand the zone. Uh... I also can't count. There we go. Now I can. Some workers will automatically plant your crops for water and harvest crops. Later in the game you'll get additional crops to choose from. Don't forget to check the fertility of your island when planning. Food production, baking bread. Oh, farm where you've withered. When you have withered crops you'll get a notification on the top. You can open the notification. And then you can directly jump to the cause of the notification. Create a mill and bakery zone. Build foundations and wall and place the objects. Right, okay. Right. Zones. Minimum. Three by four required. Right. I got found. Just the demo version. Shush you. Right, and then we want a door. Probably I can't put a door yet. I need a foundation before I can put a door down. Come on you guys. foundation. Yeah, like that. That's interesting, you're cutting this tree down. Right, in the meantime, I need a crate. Wants me to put the mill inside the building. Oh, you're, you're pretty big. And then our output there. Our worker. Oh, there's our pathway. Oh look, they have got a pathway to the door for, them, for there. Oh, that's pretty cool. Not sure about all this, but you know. Mining stone up there, these guys are. How does it look? Yeah, well, that's pretty cool. Right, these guys are getting on. Speed up a bit, you guys. Okay. Not, not 
what's the problem here? I need wood and stone. I've got wood and stone, so I'm not really sure what's taking so long. Here they come. Right. What else? I need a bakery. Yo, guys, I need a bakery. Uh, stones. Market research server spinning. Bakery. Four by three. How would this game look on your wish list? Right. And we want to foundation that and all that. And then we need to put a door there. Oh, she's making f she's making flour, which is great. And these guys have almost joined this path to the door. Oh, this pathway is can I get rid of the pathway? So Roof floor, roof objects. I wonder if it will take that out. Oh no, it is. Remove land, remove rough path. So that will take out the path, right? Okay, that's perfect. Right, you guys are doing what you need to do up here. Hmm. Quite like the music as well, actually. I mean, graphically, this game is beautiful. It really is lovely. We are fixing this orientation, so I can't turn it round, but that's fine, to be honest. Like I said, it's very much prison architect style, foundation, walls, doors, zone. Which is fine. So, I need a bread oven. I need a table, I need an input crate, and I need an output crate. There we go. And one person. Oh, hello! Oh, you're cute! Oh. Taking this chunk out here, which now makes more sense. All right. Survival fish, optional, three such points, cider, simple clothes, and bread. Okay. Research points accumulate up there, right. With research points being generated, it's a good time to build a research centre zone. No, I want to finish my fence first. Wishlist the game. Shouldn't you go away? Thank you. 
That's not what I meant at all. But look at my nice fenced in area. It's perfect. Hmm. New research center zone. Okay. Let me put it down here actually. Zones. Research. It needs to be five by four. Two, three, four. Does it need to be indoor? Yes, it does. Oh, mm. Dora. Once they've started removing the trees, it'll be easier for me to see what I will need. You. Harry Patterson, you're assigned to the harbour. You're a harbour master. Well done. Speed this up. Trees are out of the way. We need great. Let's turn you around. And a small table. There we go. And the press. Oh, look at you in your fancy hat. Research is unlocked, you can start it here. Goods will be carried to the research centre and research will be completed after some time. Unlock research in tier 2, you need to have enough research points. Okay. I want to give you another fish stock, so you want your workers to starve. You need one animal farm zone, one spinning mill zone, one apple orchard, and one cidery. Oof, that's a lot. Right, let's slow you guys down. Many idle workers. How do I get more workers? Oh yeah. Here. Like that. Thank you. Shouldn't you wish list the game? No, go away. Uh, zones. Fishing. One, two, three, four. fish at all. Where are you going with that? Oh, resources, right. An animal zone. Oh, look how lovely that is. It's so cute. Right. We've got an animal zone here. Zones. Animal farm zone. No. 
I like it. I don't know, thong. Four by four. One, two, three, four. Feeding trough, output, crate, shearing station, and water trough. Turning around. There we go. Right, now, what animals are we getting in here then? That's what the interesting questions. That's fine, that's actually not an issue. Oh, select an animal type of sheep. I need to finish, finish what we're doing first. I don't know why we're getting water. Shouldn't you wish list the game? Off you go. Tier 2 research centre. How do you get a tier 2 research centre? Zone first. Okay, roof shearing station. That is not what I wanted. This is what I wanted. Right, you guys come and do this for me, and then I'll put the water trough that I'm supposed to have in here. go right there you go now we'll have a trough Yeah, right. Should we buy some sheep? Not enough wheat in the feeding trough. Ugh. I think I'm going to need to build a bigger farm. Okay, farmer. That size. Right, can I now buy? I have five wheat to buy to buy a sheep. Of course I do.
Oh. Yay, look at that. I've got a sheep. Rusty. Oh, You are cute. You are very cute. I need a lot more yet though. In the meantime, however, we've expanded the farm. Right. Clean apple orchard. Shouldn't you wish list the game? Go away. Hmm. Where shall I put my apple orchard? Construction. Right, get rid of that. Zooms. a worker. Searches. Very well, slowly. Oh, can't see. You guys have some fun with that. And I'm hoping this is going to give us thinking. Yeah, thinking you needed to. What else can we grow? Coffee, indigo, and cotton. Should look at that later. That should help because there's now two of them and a bigger area, which is great. Zones. I need a spinning mill. Needs to be three by three. One, two, three by three. Foundation, wooden walls, and a door. And they should build their own path up to it anyway. Let's kind of zoom out and have a look again. So, this is where we're at. It's not bad, is it? game look on your wish list. Right. That's not bad really, is it? Yeah, I think that should have been another square bigger. It would have given us a lot of fast clouds, so let's slow it down a minute. There's our paths. You guys are producing a lot more wheat. 5.5. There you go. 
got a, a brown sheep. I didn't realise we were going to get different colours. That's cool. I like this guy here. He looks like a proper lumberjack. He's um, got dungarees on, hasn't he? Or he's got trousers or braces. One of the two. Oh, he's got braces. <laughs> That's cool. What about you? Oh, you've got dungarees on. Well, we're doing all right. We are doing okay. I just need a cidery zone, right? A cidery. generate new parts around the building as well which would be good. Speak you guys up a wee bit. making a lot of weird noises doing this. Right, I need an apple press, and a table, and a small crate, and an output crate. There we go. Right, we should, if I'm right in thinking, they should build a path that way. There we go. Oh, look, she looks so cute. Right, oh, she's making cider. We have 30 more workers. Right, that's the tutorial over. And these guys are looking absolutely exciting. This is such an amazing game. Uh, the graphic and art style is beautiful. And I can see why we have a lot of fun here. Because there's a whole lot more islands we can take over yet. Or expand on. There's a cloud coming over. So yeah, these guys are, are doing all sorts of fun things. Right, I think what we'll do is we will How leave would it this down. game look on your wish list? She's getting annoying though. Um, I definitely recommend giving this demo a go. It's, I think in early, I don't think it's in early access, I think it's not actually out yet, but it is going to be a cracker of a game when it does come out. I will be looking forward to maybe expanding on this once it does come out. Um, it's going to annoy me now, because I don't know. Labrea. Where are we? Yeah. Yeah, quarter two of 2022. So yeah, it's uh, not long, but oh my gosh, this is super cute and absolutely amazing and definitely recommend it. So hope you guys have enjoyed this one and I'll see you for another demo very, very shortly. I hope you guys all enjoy the Steam Next Fest 2022.